on trading systems that capture different types of market environments. This is one of our top counter trend mean reversion type strategies and the top strategy yesterday calling these trading system signals and the turning points for about $6,000 in the NASDAQ. This is the back test. This strategy was released about a year ago and you can see the results going back two years and profitable 1.84 profit factor on all trades 1.82 on the long side with 35 735 and a 5370 drawdown and you have 15075 with the 3490 drawdown on the short side here is the equity curve really nice equity curve results for this setup and so we really like this trading system for this type of market environment the vix is extremely low and volatility is extremely low and I want to look at another way share another way that we express volatility and we had an unusual event the last couple of days and this below this uh, this is the Nasdaq plotted out at Q.D. and this down here represents the zigzag count CVIX type indicator that we have CVIX capstone VIX indicator and these represent one third of one percent turning points off of a pivot point using this zigzag indicator and this counts the number of times there are those kind of those one third of one percent moves intraday and so by the end of the day on monday of last week there was nine on tuesday there were six wednesday market closed early no uh there was zero CVIX points on thursday was july the fourth the data was there the market was open since other uh, markets international markets were open but there were no uh, turning points uh, that captured this uh, one-third of one percent moves so that was zero on Wednesday and Thursday which would be expected that's not unusual the unusual part of this is um, Friday there was still no one-third of one percent turning point moves and Monday yesterday July the 8th there was still no one-third of one percent turning point moves so we throw out these days because they're holidays but these are full trading days uh, Friday and Monday are trading days they traded similar to holidays because there were no turning points and how often does this happen I've generated uh, this plot to show you the consecutive days of CVIX equal to zero not counting holidays this goes back to 2007 and you can see July the 8th, 2024. That was a rare event because it not, has not happened since August 24th of 2021. It's never been three. Uh, going back, the most it's ever been is two two days in a row of CVIX having one third of one percent moves. And then 2019, prior to the pandemic, uh, at Christmas time, again at Thanksgiving, there were these uh, two is the maximum value. Then in 2017, which recorded the lowest VIX reading ever, it, it existed. You could see several consecutive days in 2017. So 2017 was the lowest VIX year ever as far as the value of the VIX being lower. It also has a, more consecutive days in a row of CVIX equals to zero. Um, and so if I, I just plotted this actually so that... Um, we could actually see if there were more than two days in a row. And I looked at the data and there were days where there was two days in a row and then it skipped a few days and then two days in a row. And so never more than two days in a row. It also happened back in um, July of 2015, um, February of 2015, uh, August of 2014, um, June of 2014. Those are summer months. And then November of 2013. So summer months holidays, uh, Christmas, and then this on the right is the maximum CVIX daily. The 2008 Great Financial Crisis had 141 uh, turning points, uh, one-third of 1% 1 turning points back in October of 2008. Uh, the pandemic had um, 129 at its peak, it looks like. 130, actually, was the maximum value. So there, there were more, uh, there was a higher CVIX back in the great financial crisis than there was during the pandemic based on this measure. And you can see how volatility has really been crushed based on both the VIX. The VIX is, this, is, this is similar 
to the VIX, but it, it's slightly different in how it's measured. It's more incremental, um, more detailed on the number based on the number of turning points. And so you can see how the VIX has been crushed. Uh, starting in 2003, it's just really dropped off. We've only had one spike in the past year and a half. And so um, you can see that, you know, 20, this was a time period where it's really low as well. 2012 through 2015. And then um, in 2017, we had um, 2017 starts right here. And then 2018 starts in here. But you can see in, at the, in 2017, you have this number here, this value, which is about that value. So similar to 2017 right now, uh, very, very low readings in the VIX, similar to this time period. But we have strategies. Over time, we develop more strategies based on our experience to take advantage of these counter trend mean reversion type markets. Chop 2 News, Emini NASDAQ is just one of those, and it was the highlight of yesterday's trade on July the 8th, 2024. Hey, David Bean here. Welcome to Capstone Trading Systems YouTube page. Be sure to subscribe to join our community of algorithmic traders. We are real money traders. We share our winning streaks, we share our losing streaks, as well as market updates, strategies, and coding tips.